Lizzy Bird, welcome back to Super Mario RPG. In the last episode, we made our way through Land's End and Balloon Temple to take on Balloon once again, but he still got away. But if we take a look at the journal, we can catch up with the fact that we're currently in Monstro Town. Um, I hope. Actually, no, there's been no update so far. Interesting. So we'll have to see what goes on in this area, but welcome. We're in Monster Town. And what is with these doors? Uh, hi. Airflow setting? Oh, to get air conditioner. I guess a breeze. Okay. Oh my, a traveler from afar. Monster Mama. Welcome to Monster Town, where many monsters mingle. I'm the landlady, Monster Mama. Hi. A star, you say? Oh, you're here to see our star. She's upstairs, so feel free to go and take a look for yourself. Our star? Not sure if they understand what we mean. Oh, hi. I've been all around the world, but the strangest person I met is this old geezer in Rosetown. He really is weird, but definitely worth meeting. Old geezer in Rosetown. Sometimes if you bump at the right places, a treasure box will pop out of thin air. Anything like this happen to you? The treasure boxes are known as hidden treasures because they appear out of nowhere. You think you found them all, but you still have 11 hidden treasures left. Whoa, so they'll tell us how many we had to find. Very cool. Whoa, okay, so you have a new song for us. I think there's been a couple of new songs that we need to find. Um, so that is definitely something I'll keep in mind. I have a little list going of things I need to do and one of them is definitely returning to the music toad. So <laughs> that's good to know. So I'll have to keep that one in mind. But if we head down here, oh, so what do you think? Isn't our star adorable? <laughs> that was an adorable star, but uh, not the kind of star we're looking for. She's so talented too. Folks come to see her from afar. No, 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 not what we're looking for. We're looking for a star from the sky. Starbees? Oh, Star Peace. Nope, not familiar with them. So you came all the way out here to reach for a Star Peace or to search for a Star Peace? It must be really important. This is the last place on land. If you can't find it here, the only place left is up. Huh, could be the case. So, you wanna go there? Ha, huh, you're an open book. Okay, here's what you need to do. There's a secret passage to the sky at Bean Valley. But first, you must scale the cliff beyond the desert to get there. Since you're such a nice guy, I'll introduce you to someone that can help you. Paratroopers, I need you. Oh, I can hear them coming. Whoa! The paratrooper troop. What was our flying time, troops? 8.52 seconds, Sergeant. Paratroopers reporting for duty, ma'am. We're .52 seconds late. I hold myself personally accountable for the delay, ma'am. Still as rigid as ever about your rules and regulations. No need to bother with the protocol around me, Sergeant. I've got a favor to ask of you. Yes, ma'am. Anything we can do for a civilian. This fellow here really wants to get to Bean Valley. Could you help him scale the cliff? Understood, ma'am. The orders are, get mustache over the cliff. We will succeed. We will now deploy ourselves to the cliff at land's end. Paratroopers, keep a tight formation. Everyone's so nice here. I thought they would be a little bit scarier at Monster Town. We have liftoff. And off they go. They're odd, but trustworthy. Good luck with your search. Hope you find your star. And what about you? Airflow setting, gust. Airflow setting, blast. Whoa, whoa, you're furious. It doesn't seem to be doing much here, but I have a feeling that this is affecting something somewhere else. So if there's any place I'm at where it seems like there's like a big gust of wind, maybe consider that and come back here. What about this door? I did see the, wait a minute. There's a key up there. Could be that, could that be the key for the Bloom Temple? That big room? Maybe. So the super jump is your specialty, right? Those multiple jumps of yours are pretty amazing. I heard that your record for consecutive jumps stands at 13. How do you do it? Jump at least 30 times in a row and I'll give you a prize. Whoa, 30 times sounds challenging, but I'll try it. Oh, uh, whoa, you there. Rumoraza, you're quite the accomplished jumper. Can I hop on top of you and then make you do that? I don't think I can. Uh, whoa, I may be a jump, but you're totally out pumped. <laughs> A strong, silent type, huh? I don't, know. don't you dig these vibes? 
Okay, it looks like he's just gonna say that. Wait, did that, did that make the key fall off or something? It looks like it almost did. It looks closer to the edge. Keep it going, keep it going. Don't you dig these vibes? <laughs> just over and over. I'll do it one more time and see if it moves over anymore. Oh yeah, it's on the floor. Perfect, we got the temple key. That is so cool. Will we say anything more now that we've done that? Now, okay, what about you over here? It's really weird. Sometimes I hear the guy next door. He's always mumbling about a crystal this and evil that. Isn't a crystal some kind of shiny rock or something? I know I've seen it somewhere. Interesting. All right, so if we head over here, whoa, we got the dark door. It's been sealed. What's up with that? And there's an item shop in here too. So, yes, just a minute. I'll be there in a second. Oh my. Gumhild, what are you doing here? Bowser, it's been ages, hasn't it? Sorry about going AWOL on you. I ran away because I was scared to fight Smithy. A lot has happened since then, but look at how far I've come. I'm managing this store now. Hey look, you're my little ones. Come on, show your manners and greet Uncle Bowser. Aw, hi Uncle Bowser. Although I can't fight for you, I still have some items you can use. Maybe you'll find it in your heart to forgive me if I can help you get equipped. Hmm, don't worry. I'm not angry with you. I've got new minions now, and we're going to reclaim my castle. You go on with your life here. I wish you the best. Oh, that's sweet of him. All right, well, hi, guys. We want to help, too. Please, please, can we? Um, so we can buy or sell from them. What do they have? Just mushrooms, but a fair price. Um, I'll take a couple, because I did use a couple last time around, so there we go. Um, does each Goomba have their own thing? Want to help, too, please, please, can we? It looks like the same thing here, okay. Uh, and what about Papa over here? Can I not talk to him directly? What can I get you? Okay, no, they, they sell their own things too. Okay, so we got the mid mushroom, maple syrup, pick me up, cleansing juice. I don't think I need too many of these, but over here we got the spiked chomp, which is a new thing for Bowser, a studded ball and chain, sure thing. Go ahead and equip it here. And then for the courage shell, that's also for Bowser, it gives six defense and three magic defense. Do, go ahead and get that. Excellent. So that's some really good stuff. A lot of you recommended that I should sell my old stuff if I'm really in the need for money. So whatever I don't have equipped, I suppose, which I don't really know how to tell. I mean, I guess just this stuff. A lot of it is just one coin each. Oh no, 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 this is how many I have. I don't know why I got the on hand and price mix up. So I guess I could sell some of this really quickly. Um, it's just hard to tell because I had the happy show on before, right? I don't have that on right now if I check. I don't think it'll show stuff that I have equipped at the moment. Right now at the courage shell. Does that even show up in the selling list before I accidentally sell something important? It looks like it doesn't. So I think I'm free to sell all this stuff just to actually get some extra money back. And I guess worst case scenario, if I do need any of these back, I can go back and buy them. So uh, yeah, this should get us some extra money that we can use to put towards other things we need just as much. Cause I know there was something that wasn't in Marymore. Guess we'll find out. Uh, in the meantime, we have jump shoes here, which I guess we need. Oh no, that's that's why I could sell. Okay, yeah, I don't want to sell anything more there. Uh, I think we're good. Let me find out. I hope I didn't just accidentally sell a bunch of stuff I needed. Um, it looks like no, we got some good equips going on here. Um, that's good. Is that the signal ring here? So probably don't want to go too crazy because I want to keep that, but. All right, that seems good enough for me. I don't see anything else going on here. So that one product plant said that there was a, this door is locked. What were they talking about? It's really weird sometimes to hear the guy next door. He's always mumbling about a crystal this and evil that. Evil crystal. I don't think I've seen anything like that, but maybe at some point you can use that to open the door. What is this? Looks like they're not home. Feel free to rest here. The musty, the three musty fears. Interesting. Oh, oh, it's a little lamp. There we go, we can rest up here if we're feeling it. So cozy. All right. Whoa, nice to meet you. I'm Greeper. Hi, I'm Boo. And I'm Drybones. We are the three musty fears. He's sleeping. Boy, he sure is. Check those bubbles coming out of his nose. 
Maybe he can still hear us while he's asleep? Hey, Hugh, we want to play around to find the flag. Right, we'll each hide a flag somewhere around the world. Yeah, find all three flags and you'll get an awesome prize. We'll go and hide the flags. See you when you get back. And we don't get any hints or anything? They'll be back. Huh. Oh, I'm back. I hid my flag behind a wooden flower. Okay. I'm home. My flag's under a green bed. I'm back. You'll never guess my spot. It's between O and A. Our flags are invisible, so search very carefully when you think you found the spot. Farewell and good morning. Interesting, so behind a wooden flower, under a green bed, and between O and A. Sounds like quite the puzzle to search for. Okay, so with that all finished up, let's head back out here and explore more of Monster Town. Whoa, whoa, okay, I found something. Wait, was that a save spot? Okay, interesting save spot. Very odd. Uh, what is this door gonna lead to? There's a hidden treasure nearby. Okay, well first things first, thanks for coming by. Uh, you're welcome. Oh hey, here we go, pretty simple one. Get a frog coin. And what's inside of here? Hello? Whoa, okay, wait, we're back out. So that was just the exit of Monster Town. Interesting, wasn't expecting that. So we have a couple more things we still have to do here. First off, the letter J, who is this for? Oh, hi, Jagger, who is it? Sorry, but the sensei isn't in. Oh my gosh, Jagger? Bowser, no, I haven't seen you for so long. I've been studying here at the dojo under the sensei Jinx because, to tell you the truth, I, I knew I couldn't beat Smithy. That's why I'm here now. Someday, I'm going to return and make you proud. Don't worry about me. I've got new minions now. We're going to take back my castle. You stick to your guns. Train like there's no tomorrow. Very cool. Well, good luck with that, Jagger. My sensei is out right now, but he'll be back so shortly. In the meantime, will you accept the challenge from me? Sure. Great. You know that I'm not going to make it easy for you, right? Well, we just saved, so let's go for a fight. Well, you attacked first there. Let's see what we can do. Maybe we'll use our triple move against it, the clown car barrage. This will really make it difficult for you. Let's see how not easy you're gonna go on us. I mean, after this, I should definitely use the, uh, the scanner, but for right now, boom, hit you for 235. That feels pretty good. Let's get a thought peek in there. Here we go. All right, 365 health left over. I'm so excited my blood is boiling. All right, so, yeah, this is the new um new item for Bowser. But there we go, 138 there. We're hitting for pretty darn good damage. There we go, whoa, huge stuff. Yikes, you're tough. And that's the fight, very cool. Yikes, guess that was to be expected. Mario, you're a top-notch fighter. You did well for your ex inexperience, Shacker. Whoa, hey, hey, wait a minute. Sensei, have you been here all along? Hmm, you felt my key, didn't you? Not bad for a novice. Is this the Sensei? Whoa, your fighting style. It isn't as foolproof as you think. I'll accept the challenge any day. No way, Jinx is so fast. Uh. Sure. You wish to challenge me? Um, no. Let me first make sure we're healed up from that fight we just did. Tsk, tsk. Afraid, are we? I'm not afraid. I'm just cautious. All right, we're good. We're, we're healed up. So let's try this out against Jinx. Whoa. I don't know if we'll win, but I'll certainly try. All right. Let's see what you're capable of. Should have sh saved that uh, gauge for this, but whoa. So fast. Oh, no. Oh, was not ready for that one. Not good. Let's go ahead and try some crazy moves straight away then. Let's just do a super fireball against you. Ooh, got it. Resistant, okay, not good. Let's try a thought peek then and see what we can get done with this one. 600 health, no weaknesses. But, oh, it didn't do the thought, so I didn't time it well. And I'm missing, jeez. Tough, so tough. Okay, let's just do a normal attack, do 90 damage to you. 
Ow, 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 ow. The combos. Jinx is terrifying so far. That one I might have done too early. Darn, how am I having a hard time with that? <laughs> I don't know. There we go, 112 damage. Okay, that's how I blocked it. There we go, excellent. Now we're doing a little bit better. Malo, do this thaw peak one more time. Come on. You don't have the experience to beat me. I don't know, we got you halfway down. I got the perfect block now too. I'm getting better at this move. We're stacking stuff up. Uh-oh, Valor up. So, Mario, go ahead and do this again. This is a pretty easy one to land, but I do want to sort of change, or maybe we could do this one, I don't know. HP will hit A just before the, okay. What if I switch over to Peach and just do a full group HP revive? Yeah, here we go. Okay, that seems pretty good. And then we can try Crusher against you. There we go, 30 damage is not as much as I was hoping, but our gauge goes up. Miss, darn. Nice, all right, that's really good. This is getting lower and lower. Ah, oh, couldn't quite get it that time. It's a guy. 54 damage. 16, not too much here. I might wanna switch out Peach again. Good block though. Oh no, the miss. Bowser, toss another. 58 damage, we're getting closer. Phew, simply amazing. Was that it? Okay. Very cool. I guess I underestimated you. You pack quite a punch. But don't let it go to your head, because I let you have that round. Let's have a rematch. R right now? You wish to challenge me? Sure, we'll do it one more time and see if it's any harder. All right, you asked for it, and no crying if you get hurt. We'll just see, because I don't really know if it's gonna have anything extra. Uh, Okay, so instead of this, we'll do Gino. I wanna try this Gino whirl again. Ooh. That was definitely not good timing by me, but I really wanna keep trying that until we get 99, 99 again, because that was crazy. 86 damage there. Ow. Okay, Bowser. Cool. Gino whirl. Way too soon this time. Got it. Okay, Mario, get some of that. We're doing some pretty simple moves so far, but if it works, it works. I just wanna get better at this. Way too soon again. The Valor goes up for you. Maybe I'll just kick one of these over one more time. I don't know if he's actually any more difficult this time, though, is the thing. He's gonna charge up. 24, so yeah, I don't know, that's really tough. <laughs> Probably by design, I mean, I don't know if it's like a chance based thing to get it that high up. Let's go ahead and just do a super jump, because remember, my goal for this was to get 30. Apparently, that's what the other guy said, so let's see if I can't do that right now. Didn't even know if it was possible to get that high. It does definitely doesn't seem easy. Bowser getting beat up now. between Gino Whirl and the Super Jump. Okay, no, no, Mario's knocked out. Uh-oh, blocking that one now. Hopefully he doesn't have too much more health. Uh, I think I'll try the Gino Whirl one more time. 24. I must have just gotten really lucky those two times. Whoa, that was a new one. Let's go ahead and switch to Peach. We will do the comeback on Mario, of course. And hopefully I time that well enough. Will you get the full health back? Ah, uh, not quite. All right, uh, I can't afford that anymore. And then maybe to switch you to Malo, just to see how much health you have left. 127, we're getting there, we're getting there. Sympathy, not for me. Oh, not good. Thought I blocked that in time. I guess I didn't. Uh, 30 damage there. Ow, Mario too. You are so tough, dude. All right, Gino Beam, let's try this one. 
Ooh. Come on. 44 is not bad. Ow. No, he knocked us out. Oh no, okay, our other friends jump in. I didn't know it worked that way. That's actually really cool. Good to know. I thought that once our party was out, it was out, but not the case. We're still kicking. Bowser. I missed. Not good. 26 damage there. Peach, go ahead and two damage, not what I wanted. I pressed A for that one. That was really weird. Uh, I guess I should've done my special move, I had the chance. What I'll do here then, phew, simply amazing. We got you, just barely, but we got you. So tough. We don't get any experience or anything for it. Still haven't had enough? It isn't often that I have someone this competitive to spar with. All right, this match will be the one that counts since I'm placing my reputation on the line. Okay, so we're doing one more. Everybody's back up the full strength. Uh, we could do Starry Shell Spike here, but I could also do something like this, Shooting Star Shot. This seems good. Let's try this out. You wish to challenge me? Yes, I do. Watch closely, Jagger. You're about to see your sensei in action. So hopefully we can keep this going. Whoa, really? The instant one hit takedown? Okay, we can't stand for that. We're gonna go back in here and do the comeback. There we go, and that should be the full health refill too. Excellent. And right now the triple move would be Starry Shell Spike, right? That seems pretty good to me. Might as well keep with it. Mario's ready, the rest of the squad is too. They're jumping in. Here we go. And the superstar. Boom, 42, doesn't seem like much, but against this guy, I'll take whatever we can get. Let's do something like poison gas. I think getting guaranteed damage over time might be good if he's not resistant to it. It's a miss. Okay, it might just be good to just focus on like purely more physical attacks and stuff like that. I will keep with Chino, because if I could get this 99.99. 99. 39. Now whenever I see the number nine, I'm just gonna be super excited for a second. Can we somehow get to 30 with this? I'd be really happy. Ah, not even close. Okay. Can't believe that's possible. Seems like it's really difficult. Going with the Geno Whirl again. 39 damage. That was not even a... There we go, a good timing one. So my chain goes down because of that, unfortunate, but we'll get back to it. Got it, 56 there. Oh, that was great, excellent. 39, I don't know. Okay, they missed, wow, that's uncommon. Let's go with this one as long as we can. Only like 10 or 11, so tough. 86. Ah, oh, couldn't quite get the block there. Our Gina's gonna be our last Gina Whirl. Make it count, buddy. 39, okay. <laughs> Let's see, I'll just do a normal one. Unfortunately missing, but it doesn't mess up my chance. That's at least good. 30 damage here, gauge up. Gina, go ahead and do that. 46 damage too. It is like those normal attacks are doing just as much as Ow. The other stuff. So I really probably should be saving my FP for like healing and that kind of thing. Oh, come on. Okay, this is where we switch. I mean, I guess, yeah, I'll switch to Peach to get her to come back Bowser. Ah, oh, a little too early on that one. But at least he's back up. Mario can go ahead and kick you for six, that's it? Crazy. Uh, I'll use an, I don't know if I should use an item. Let's see how much damage that does. 22, blocked it, excellent. Oh, but you can attack twice and you knocked out Peach this time. Unfortunate. Okay, what can I do here instead? Um, I could Thaw Peak just to see how far along we are. Very risky to do that when, okay, 400 until this is insane. I've committed your every move to memory. Oh no. Uh, Maybe we could, all, re all members recover fully. <sighs> Let's do this one. Froglicola party recovers 80 HP. 
There we go. That seems pretty tasty too, right? Got a freebie too out of all times. That's an, that's an excellent time to get a freebie. Blocked it. And I mean, I could try a normal jump. 10 damage. It's just more that time goes on, the more it's taking. Recovers all FP. Let's do Maple Strip. That should be good enough for now. Okay, Bowser. You could try Terrorize this time. I'm just hoping one of these doesn't miss. There we go. Got the foot up straight away. Yes! 17, but they're resistant to the effect. And Mario's out again. Such a crazy move. I need to like really memorize how to knock that out. Um because if not, this gets really scary really fast. Peach is still knocked out. That's one of those things where all I can really I don't know if I actually have an item. Pick me up. Revise the down ally. Okay, yes, I do. There you go. And then once Peach does that, hopefully she can. Yeah, she's. Oh no, it's all down again! You're kidding me! Oh, that's the worst. This is so tough. Um, what's this do, Gino World? If I could get so lucky and hit you for a billion damage, I'd be so happy. Don't think it's gonna happen, but you never know. Okay, so this is where I do pick me up on Mario. Back at the full with that, right? Excellent. Blocked it, nice. Okay, so our current triple move is shooting star shot. Let's just go for it. Hit him with everything we have, because you never know what's gonna happen next. Ooh, everybody jumps up. This is so cool, come on. He's gotta do something good. 18, 16, 19, 17, that's some good damage stacking up. Ow, Mario almost knocked out. Hitting it for 40. Okay, we're getting somewhere again. I go for it again, Gino Whirl. 25, not bad. Blocked it perfectly, excellent. His vigor goes up, which probably upgrades his health or something. I don't know, I don't wanna know. We're gonna do a mid mushroom here, I guess. I, I, I don't wanna do the max mushroom. Cool. And then, ah, darn, only 20 there. Do I go for it again? I need to save some of the FP. This will be the last time I use it. 25, still isn't bad. Come on, Mario out again. Do I use the pick me up here? Sure, well is Peach out right now? Peach is out right now, darn. Um, Yeah, okay, I think I used a pick me up on, I don't know. Maybe I do switch to Peach soon. It's sort of a hard situation. Um, I'll try this. Then, pick me up on Peach. If she could just survive after that, that'd be great, but easier said than done. Never mind. yeah, that move is really, really tough to dodge. So I'll just keep the Bowser. We'll try to attack you down. 16 damage isn't too much this time. I blocked that one perfect though. All right, Bowser. I need to go ahead and use pick me up on Bow or Mario. I just hope he doesn't get one-shotted again. Ooh, I miss, no. Come on! It's just like such like a, a fraction of a moment that you have to dodge at. He's gotta be getting low though, Ah. Oh. Switch, switch to Malo. I could try like Thunderbolt and see where we're going with it. Is that too much resistance? No, we just can't really rely on that. 10 damage there. Ah, oh, not gonna be able to block it this time either. Oh my gosh, that is such an insanely difficult move. Um, Switch, I don't have anybody to switch to, so I'll just have to skip item, pick me up. I'll try it on Malo. If this doesn't work, I just, I probably have to just try the fight again. It would be nice if I could, you know, I'd have to reload my save though, wouldn't I? Because I'm using so many items. I wanna see how close he is to getting knocked out here. 71, we can do this, for sure. I've committed here, I've removed the memory. We'll see about that. Gonna hit you with 13. Got the block there. Oh, it's so impossible, come on. Um, Item, pick me up, Mario, it's our last one. So I probably should have saved it for Peach, but it's just difficult to get to that situation. Got a freebie, got a freebie, thank you. Switch to Peach for now. Ow, and there goes Malo. We're gonna skip you. Go like this, pick me up on Peach. 
Okay, we got a freebie again. That's crazy, actually. So, switch to whoever. I, I think Gino. Impossible. <laughs> Come on. Uh, I will switch. Special. Come back, Mario. Here we go, here we go. If we could just do that, and that'll be a full health refill because of the, the proper timing. This is so challenging. I don't like it. Uh, I think we just do a normal attack. Eight damage, it's just so much slower. Ow, oh, he's not even doing the fun, easy move to skip where he punches us up and then slams us back down. I can't really skip you to anybody, so I just skip. Mario, pick me up on Peach. It has to be Peach so that she can use her spell. I don't know, I don't know how to dodge that. Um, I have to skip, I have to do uh, a yeah, comeback on either Mario or Gina. I'll try Gina this time. There we go, got it. It's so incredibly challenging, and I'm just like just barely scooching by. I need to take this opportunity to do some stuff. Well, maybe, like, maybe I should use Yoshi. Summon Yoshi during battle. Help me out here, Yoshi. Let's see what this does. Yoshi, please help. Eat the cookie. Beat this guy up. Resistance? Resistance? No! Yoshi, that was your one chance. Uh, skip. Blocked it. Okay. What do we got? Geno Beam? Hit it with the Gino, be Gino Beam. Perfect. 34 damage ain't bad. Attack again. 21, we're getting close. That's so close. Oh my goodness, I can't believe we did it. No way. Whew. Whoa, you're a stronger champion, no doubt about it. My reputation was staked on this last fight, so I've lost the title of sensei. From today, you are the sensei of this dojo. Please take this belt, which only the highest ranking fighter in the dojo can wear. Whoa, you got a jinx belt. We'll rename the dojo Mario Style Dojo and incorporate your jump technique into the training. That's crazy, I can't believe we just barely did it. What's he doing? I think he changed the sign. Jagger and I will start our training immediately. 1,000 warm up jumps, ready, begin. <laughs> well, good luck with this. Mario Sensei, the new regimen will strengthen us, right? I hope so. Master, share your wisdom with us. All right, well, that was a crazy fight. And I think the only unfortunate thing is I don't think I got those pick-me-ups back. So like, you know, I really had to try for that. But I do wanna see, okay, the Jinx spell is right here, Jinx's Emblem of Power. So I guess it doesn't have any status effect, but it gives so many stats. As you can see, it increases attack, defense, and speed significantly. So if I was gonna put that on anybody, it would probably be Gino. Just making him sort of like this really powerful damage kind of thing seems pretty good to me. So we'll try that, the Jinx spell on Gino. And we'll head out of here. That was crazy. Look at them on there too. So cool. I can't get up there, so I guess that's really most of this area explored. So it's a couple of things we still need to do though, right? I wanna go back here um, to, what was it? Uh, Balloon Temple? Because if we can get back into that one room, maybe I can open it up now that we have the key, right? But what made it so that the key, or that we got to that room, you know? If I hit it now, will it be the same thing? I don't know. I can't hit it now. So if I leave, come back, it's lowered. I hit it, it gives me a scroll. I'm so hungry, I wish I had something to eat. See, that's not what I want. The yellow tile will get you to the next room. So, what if I go back even farther and did the combo I did before? Would that work? Not quite sure. Because what I did was middle, left, right. I'm pretty sure. We can see that these are all 50 coins. Let's try that. See the three faces and I'll hit them in any order. So let me try that again. Like maybe this is the trick to it. I did middle, left, right. The blocks fall down. If you proceed to the next door, you'll have many friends in the future. Got the same one. And then we got you again. Do I have to fight you again? We'll see, we'll see. Uh, if this doesn't work, I'll try doing like the exact thing I did. I gotta defeat all three of these enemies though. So. Got a good amount of damage there. One hit knockdown, good attack up. There we go. 
Nice. Okay, so we should be able to turn through these enemies, no problem. Nothing too crazy, so I'll just do this really quickly and we'll head into the next room. All right, so this door is opening one more time. And we got the spring. We know about all that, but what will this door be down here? Is it what I'm looking for? I guess we have to hit this. I'm so hungry, I wish I had something to eat. So no, it's not the same one again. So what else did I do differently? I'm not really sure. It must have just been that cloud I knocked out. Yeah, I mean, you're here now, which you weren't here before. So I'll keep experimenting and we'll figure it out eventually. Okay, this time I just kept going in and out, in and out, and just see if we got a different one. And I guess it must just be random then, because that's how I got a different one. I hadn't known if it was just a weird coincidence or what, but that time I just, I don't know, I just went in and out of the room. But the key you have there looks pretty tasty. Uh, give him the key. Here you go. Whoa. Crazy, and he just flies off, so let's see what we get here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight frog coins, as well as a fire bomb, royal syrup, and a max mushroom. Then, of course, also some extra FP. What a wonderful surprise. Really happy about that. We got a lot more frog coins. We're up to 30 of them now, which is fantastic. So we're doing a whole lot better with that stuff. Exactly what I want to see. So I guess for now, we don't have to stick around here if we don't want to. I don't think there's really anything more to do in this temple. So if we go back to the map, what is our even goal to do now, now that we got that done in Monster Town? Uh, I'm not even entirely sure, it's a little odd, but uh, I could leave for now and see what else there is going on. I mean, I think that there was some previous stuff in the older towns, but I could go back to Land's End. I mean, that's where the flag is, as if there's more here. So I'm definitely curious about that, but in the meantime, what other towns are there to get to? Because now might be a good time to sort of go around and figure that out because we have over here Rose Town. I think there was something more in Rose Town. So I'll poke around here and we'll find out. There is a spot here in the back of Rose Town I don't remember getting to. I don't really remember this house very much. Hi, hmm, I'm the gardener. See that huge planter? I've spent many years seeking the legendary seed and fertilizer to fill it, but had no luck. Huh, I could only find them. Seed and fertilizer. I don't think I have either. Legendary seed and fertilizer. So I'll look around for that. I have not seen that, but this is definitely something new. Can I go down your chimney? I cannot. <laughs> Interesting. So I'll have to take a look around for an ancient seed, ancient fertilizer. Haven't seen that anywhere, but I guess there's at least one new thing in Rose Town. I'll look around for anything more. Okay, so I'm no longer in Rose Town, I'm in Moleville, and over here, good to see you again, I'll show you my inventory. I'm number two, a mystery egg. I have no idea what it does, it sort of grows on you, huh? It's yours for 200 coins, I don't have it, so I might as well grab it. Nice doing business with you. Here you go, that's all I got for now. Interesting. So I have a mystery egg now, so I'll have to look, look at that at some point. I'm so hungry, I sure wish I had a Carbo cookie. I don't think I have a Carbo cookie at the moment, but maybe I can buy one? Let's see. Uh, bye. Do they sell carbo cookies? They don't. So, I don't know if I have any, if I've even run into any before, but if I find one, I guess I could give it to her. In the meantime, what else is there to do around here? I don't know if there is too much more, but I know that we also think about the Booster's Pass for something. Some of you were mentioning, I can't quite remember what for right now, though. Okay, my Booster Pass, and I do not remember this cave over here. Uh, yeah, this seems new, is it? I don't know, we got these little red spiny guys, and they're just spikies, which we've definitely taken a look at these guys before. I'll try to fight one right now, and it should be a pretty easy one to take down on both of them. Uh, there we go. Uh, is that all that much experience? No, it's literally one experience, so I don't think we need to fight these guys, but, oh, hello. Yeah, this seems very different. Can I talk to you? Golly, you're that famous Mario guy. If I beat you, they'll make me Snifster number four if I'm lucky. All right, well, we're fighting Apprentice. This guy is definitely new, so we should switch over to you and Thought PQ. Ooh, come on. Got it. 120 health isn't bad. That should be a one-hit takedown. Being an Apprentice is tough. I can't take much more. All right, ready, and there we go. One-hit takedown with Peach. Excellent, great job. So, you're not too much for that, but why? Now they'll make me, make, make me take the training course all over again. Poor apprentice. 
Okay, what else is going on around here? Whoa, boom. We got the Krakakola put in the storage box, as well as a frog coin and some FP. Very, very cool. So I don't think there's really too much more to do here then, but I'll keep looking around to make extra sure. But that was a fun little bonus for, for sure. I'm happy we found that. So now with that done, it's still a bit of a mystery on what exactly I get to next, but it's saying that the flag is still at land's end. So I can only guess that I missed something here. If we take a look at the journal, has anything new popped up? Not from the monster list, that's for sure. But if I go back, not there, but over here to the scrapbook. Okay, yeah, head for the sky. Oh yeah, Monster Mama told us about the place in the sky. So we're going to climb the cliff in Land's End on our way to Bean Valley. I'm excited to see what's up there. And then Jinx round three. We want a hard fall battle against Jinx, whose reputation was on the line. He claims that he'll begin intensive jump training to run the place as a Mario style dojo. But will he really? I guess we'll have to wait and see. Okay, very cool. So it seems like we're off in the right direction. We'll at least try to get to this new area and see what we can find. But I'm not quite sure at the moment. Uh, for right now though, definitely wanna get up here. And we've got these guys again, but I should be able to avoid them. And we're gonna continue this way. Uh, so far, you know, this all seems pretty normal. So I'm not exactly sure exactly where the cliff is, but we'll keep fighting for now, and we'll see what ends up happening. <laughs> They're gonna attack each other. There you go, not bad. And then Malo can finish off the Gekket. Very cool. We shouldn't get too much coins or experience for this just because, actually 16 experience, not too bad, compared to what we were doing before at the least. There we go, we got through that. We've seen all of this before, but oh no. Gotta fight these guys first, I guess. I hit one of them. Uh, ah, not a good block. That was better. I don't know, but we're a mushroom. Okay. Got it. I hit the other two too, so that's good. I missed that, that's good if they miss that. I blocked that one. All right, here's our chance. Hit you there. And Peach, if you don't mind just finishing off the other one. Cool. All right, let's get back to climbing up there because, oh, we got a level up for that too. So Princess Peach gets a level up. That's good, level 17. I think for this one, I definitely wanna upgrade magic. It wasn't like over here or anything, right? I mean, I guess, oh yeah, I sort of remember. Oh, he's not here to bring me up. There was the little thing over this way, but it just led to the one sewer pipe, so that can't be it either. So I just gotta keep going until I figure out what exactly we're trying to get to. Okay, so I fought some more enemies. I got a level up for Mario for it, level 18, and Mario learned a new move, Ultra Fireball. Fire at everyone, push A repeatedly. That sounds amazing, and to probably celebrate that, I should boost the magic damage a little bit more, right? And Malo, of course, following Mario's footsteps with a level up, level 18. And Malo learned a new move, Star Rain, a falling star. Press A when it hits for more bounces. That sounds so cool. So I think for this one, well, upgrade physical for now. But, get up this way, dodge his enemies as much as possible. I'm still trying to find the entrance to this whole thing. Okay, I've been following this ant, you know, as we have before to get to the balloon temple, but instead of going through, I think what would have been the last time here, I'm just now noticing right up here, there's an opening. Whoa, okay, this has to be it because I've looked everywhere else I could have found anything. Ten up, all troops in position. Mario, your mission is to scale the cliff by jumping shell to shell. Whoa, okay, very cool. So. There's that, we have to climb to the very tippity top of this thing, so let's give it a go. Is there anything cool or hidden or secret on the sides though, before we do? Uh, doesn't seem like it. So, I'll get up here, and oh, whoa, whoa. It's timed and everything, pretty spooky. But I'll just, ah, oh, no, I fell, I fell. Not good, not good. Try that again. Definitely a little bit to get used to, but I can just jump up here, and this one brings me that way. Oh, it's so slippery. Darn, what is he gonna say? Don't give up. Sure, instead he does it. Now try it again. Will do. So I'm gonna climb back up here. Jump around a little bit more. Got it. Ah, oh, it's always that one that's so tricky. Darn, uh, one more time. All right, 
Run back up there. Land on this. It's hard because you know you really only want to move two directions here, but oh, you can move three of them. Okay, I gotta jump on you, don't I? And then you'll go up. Yes, you will. Boom, I made it, awesome. Mission accomplished. Elapsed time is 13.83 seconds. Not bad for a civilian, especially one without wings. Uh, is there anything more I can talk to you about? I guess not. Cool, okay, so it's gonna go on over this way. It looks like we're heading to a new area over here, which of course is gonna be Bean Valley. So I had a lot of fun, of course, exploring a little bit more of Land's End and Monster Town today, but it looks like we'll have more to do in the next episode of Super Mario RPG. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.